There we go. So, as a natural holistic nutritionist and health coach, I feel it's superiorly important to lead by example and really give people a sense of what it really doesn't take um, to have and live a really healthy lifestyle. Um, the truth is, I don't overload myself with supplements and a whole bunch of other jargon and sponsors and whatnot. It's very superiorly minimalistic. Um, for natural lifestyle content, I will uh, embellish everyone who, over the last eight years or so, had a desire to see me shave. Um, the truth is, it's the same lifestyle habits that I had when I was growing a beard. It's going to be the same skin and beard oil, which is coconut oil. Um, the difference is, instead of um, personal care being done with scissors, it's going to be done with razor choices. And um, I do know how much content is made around razors and shaving and personal care hygiene and care and such on and so forth. So you guys get super dull, boring content today of knowing that, uh, you know, how I clean my razors. Well, it's the same way I clean uh, my medicine inhaler. Um, the MacGyver way with a paper clip. There's a his way and a her way. And get these over in elemental growth. Well, if you talk to her, she'll show you how to make one. When I do shave, I uh, go a little bit traditional. So, I'll give you guys a dull, boring content example of a lifestyle choice of what it looks like for me to just shave. Not a super believer of shaving, however, interestingly enough, I do feel better on a emotional scale just to get the uh, little hair receptors made of silicon. They pick up on all the atmospheric static and whatnot. Um, it's true behind the spirituality that the more hair you have, the more uh, sensitive you are to your environment. So if you're along the line of being a little bit super sensitive as an empath, sometimes being a clean cut helps. I want hot. I don't want to freaking burn myself either. I currently don't have any oil on my skin yet. You guys also get to see a little bit of the lifestyle hacks for calisthenics. The different yoga poses and how you can balance yourself dipping your head into the sink like this. Activates a lot of good muscle movement too. Oh, I feel nice. Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay, so. Oh, see. Relaxation, anti anxiety technique, uh, a biochemical science lesson side part. This is your cerebellum here, right at the bottom of your. Um, where your skull meets your spine, your brain stem. Oh, hot or cold water? Either or. For anxiety, usually you want cold water because you're overheating and you're like, ah, freak it out. Or, you know, it's depression. You're too tense. 
get cold. A little bit of warm water there. Oh, wow, it goes a long way. It's Canada in the winter, so my skin's dry and cold. So if I'm going to hit it with a razor, I want to make sure it's uh, conditioned properly. Because again, I don't use shaving cream. I don't use any of that gunk. Pure coconut oil for everything. Apple cider vinegar for shampoo or in the bath water for soap. That's about it. I don't have a plug, so I just gotta use Kleenex each time. Good video, too. One sec. 